Okay guys, okay. suerte ¿eh? yeah. Vámonos Vámonos <laughs> Yeah! Okay, Fernanda, how's it going? <laughs> Heading to the summit. Here we are. And that's the top of Antarctica. Take this! <laughs> yeah! Good job, guys. Awesome. Good job, Good you. Job. Great job, everyone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Great job. <laughs> Good job, you. Yeah. <gasps> oh. I feel a mix of emotion. Eh? I'm a bit um, nervous as always. Uh, well, just now in the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, nine hours, 40 minutes. All right. Yeah. There we go. Six hours, 40 minutes up, three hours down. Super good! Oh my gosh! It's a magic place. Yeah, I I suffer a lot at the end because the altitude and the cold was crazy cold with the wind. Whoa. So Mount Vinson is the highest mountain of Antarctica. It's crazy that uh, I've been the first person uh, able to run up and down the Mount Vinson. It's, uh, I know that is one mountain that many people come to climb. It's crazy amount of people. And, uh, and uh, they get crazy when they see that I was able to run it. But everything was aligned, you know? And uh, you could have, you had so much fun in the go down in this 1,200 meters <laughs> rope in this 
deep wall was so funny to run that, it's crazy. Just one hand on the rope and you go far. So the condition here is completely extreme. So it's minus 30 to minus 50. The wind uh, like made this worse. And uh, the route is hard. Uh, you have some very steep walls to, to go up and uh, some rock sessions. It's not so easy as I've been thinking before. The biggest challenge here was uh, to get the permit uh, to, go, to go up and down in my way. I really like to go in the roads, especially here in Antarctica. Uh, what is unique about this, this project here in Antarctica that I want to, to go fast in Mount Vinson is because I love to move fast. Uh, Antarctica is, is one place that completely remote and wild. It uh, always was my dream to come here. Well, I'm learning that uh, whatever you love, we are here as a visitors, you know, in our life and um, in, our, in this continent, you really feel that. I, I was also a bit tired because I climbed and then after I had one day off and I climbed again to do the speed record. So I felt like my legs are a bit stiff in the beginning, but after I was so happy and with everything was so good and this mountain everywhere, everything is white and uh, bring, look like it's peace, you know, it's peace everywhere. I think that will be my memory from here this giant piece of ice that uh, mix with the, the clouds and uh, you feel that you are in the sky all time. I love doing this project in big mountains. I love to change my kind of trainings to get more skills, uh, to go for high mountains, to be safe there. So I've been learning a lot how to move in this, this extreme place.